Hello Capricorn, this is you versus them for the 12th through the 18th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what's been going on for you. Page of Pentacles, something that you guys are interested in. I think that um, there's something new that you're interested in, or you, you're you're approaching something with caution. I feel okay for sure. Something you guys are approaching with caution. Let's see what's going been going on for them. Hmm. This person has ended something. Um, I feel like there is some transformation going on with them. Some changes going on with them. Something that they um, are leaving behind that they feel like is not no longer good for them. Going towards their happiness here. Hmm. See what's keeping you guys from this person. What's keeping Capricorn from this person? No balance and harmony, no happiness with this person. Um, you felt like this relationship was toxic is what I'm getting from you guys. Um, that you guys just could not get along. There's a lack of coming together um, with this person is what I'm getting from you guys here. You're just really trying to choose, you know, what will make you happy. What's going to bring harmony and balance back into your life here is what I feel that Page of Pentacles is there for. It's like, what do I need to do to, you know, get bring in the things that I want into my life, into fruition, you know? So there's just a lack of getting along with this person, I feel. Let's see what's keeping this person from Capricorn. Queen of Pentacles. Maybe this person, um, there could be somebody else that, you know, was in between you guys. Um, but I, I'm getting that this person had unrealistic expectations, honestly. And they may have felt like, like the grass was greener on the other side. Um, some of them may have left for somebody else here. Somebody they felt like um, maybe had the money, the status, you know, whatever. And um, could quite possibly be that. Or this person was all about themselves, very selfish, you know, just wanted to keep everything, their money, to themselves, um, do whatever it was that they wanted to do. Um, I'm feeling a very selfish energy here with this individual. Okay. And then we have temperance under the bottom of their deck here. Um, I'm, I'm feeling like this person felt that uh, right now is what I'm getting here. That this person, there's a possibility that this person wants to come back wants to work things out with you, um, wants to be happy with you. It's just what I'm getting from this, okay? But there is a possibility, again, that they left um, for someone. They could have even felt that you guys, um, that you're blocking them, that, that you... Um, felt too like you were too good for them even for some of you maybe they feel like right now that you guys are out of their league even okay let's see what's currently going on for Capricorn what's currently going on for Capricorn the nine of wands tired I think you guys are tired but I think that you know you're pushing through this energy um, of like you know wanting to throw in a towel wanting to give up on love wanting to give up on a social life you know being with someone and I think um, right now you're just really trying to to get that spark back to get that fire back um, and, and go for those things again that make you happy you just want balance and harmony in your life okay um, 
I do feel like a lot of you are are probably open to having communication with this person, trying to get back together even for some of you. Maybe some of you have offered um, an apology or something to this individual if you feel like there's something that you guys have done. I, I definitely get that. Maybe it's a Sagittarius individual or Scorpio individual that you guys are dealing with. Or somebody wants to make an apology to you. There's something about an apology that's coming through. Okay. Let's see what's currently going on for them. The moon. Um, this person's going back and forth, very moody. I feel like definitely they're going through some changes here. They are hiding a lot, not only from you, but from other people. They're, I feel like this person's kind of secretive, but they, they have all of these deep feelings and emotions. I feel like this person is very intuitive as well. Okay. But there's a lot that they don't reveal, a lot that they don't say. But I definitely get that they have very deep feelings for you. Hmm. I almost get too that this person is, is going through like um, some depressive episodes with this moon energy here. And there's probably a need for them to actually like, you know, if they are not already conversing with their mother and talking to her, then maybe, you know, there's a need for them to do that. Maybe they have been calling on her. If she has passed on, I feel like this person may be, you know, asking for guidance even in this situation, okay? Help from the angels. Let's see. <clears throat> What's influencing Capricorn here? What's influencing Capricorn? The three of wands. Definitely looking for things that make you happy. That's it. That's, that's all I'm getting from you. You guys just want to be happy. You want to move on. You want harmony in your life. You want peace, serenity. It's what I'm getting from you. And you're looking for the one. Okay. It's influencing them. Is a ten of wands feeling very tired I feel like this person is um, they're coming to the end of something though because tens are endings um, you know laying that burden down laying down the responsibility um, the weight that's on their shoulders of maybe holding things inside maybe this person is ready to open up okay maybe they're ready to open up because I get that they hold a lot in and I think that it's like really getting to them at this point. Let's see what's coming in for Capricorn. What's coming in for Capricorn here? King of Swords. Hmm. Somebody wants to say something to you. I feel like this person wants to say something to you. They come off as cold though. But they're they're really not they're really not non-filling. They just come off as aloof. But this person has really deep feelings for you that they probably have not even like revealed to you. But I definitely get that they want to um, go forward with you guys. They do not want you to leave them behind. They're they're trying to come to grips with um, whatever whatever they are feeling that's keeping them like hang on guys sorry guys my baby boy was calling me so but they definitely want to go on with you whatever it was that they have been hiding or things that they've been keeping to themselves i definitely get that they want to to speak with you guys they don't have um well they do have the ten of wands there Hmm. Yeah, they're coming out of something. They're definitely coming out of something here. Hmm. Let's see what's coming in for them. What's coming in for them? They're walking towards something for sure. Page of Swords. Hmm. They're making very slow progress. 
they're going from like really hiding and really like you know going back and forth in their mind about how they're feeling trying to like you know figure out what it is that they really want and then they think about speaking about it okay so they're making baby steps is what i'm getting here um very strong air sign here aquarius libra gemini energy here as well okay um scorpios here taurus virgo capricorn like yourself sagittarius is here um cancer pisces energy is here as well but um so they're making slow progress i feel mm -hmm. probably observing your actions trying to see you know if you've actually moved on with someone else or what it is that you're actually doing in your life currently all right so let's see what's blocking you guys what's blocking capricorn here The three of pentacles the fact that you guys i feel cannot work together um this person could have quite possibly had you in a three-party relationship and i think that's what you're feeling okay i think that's that's why you are you have your back turned to this um and just wanting to kind of move on is what i'm getting from you guys maybe there was not a coming together you guys could not compromise i feel again you know there was not no harmony in this situation you feel no balance no no really like the getting along part you know every other day you're arguing kind of thing and um i think you're at this point where you just want to work on yourself and maybe build new new friendships new relationships here it's what i'm getting from you guys okay it's like you are wanting to you know spend your time elsewhere you're focused on other things other than this person okay let's see what's influencing them what is influencing them the three of pentacles huh we're blocking them look at this you guys are just not wanting to work together you're wanting to kind of do your own thing there you know and I don't get that you don't want to work together. You feel like that you can't work together here. You're feeling like you can't work together here. But if you notice with your three of pentacles here, you're by yourself. I feel like you're rebuilding, um, you know, relationships and, and things somewhere else. You're working on yourself. Primarily, you're just going to work. Primarily. Okay. And that's where your um your your you know your mental stability comes from right now is focusing on your work. But I feel like with this person, with them, they are possibly working with other people. Okay. Involved with other people. May again have had you guys in a three party relationship here. There is not a coming together here. You guys have two different um, ways of viewing this situation and how you can make it work. Your points of view is different. Okay. So that is definitely an issue. You guys do not see eye to eye. All right. So let's see what the advice is for Capricorn. What is the advice for Capricorn? Advice for Capricorn. Hmm. I I feel is to continue doing what you've been doing. Um, you know, just compromising in the situations where you know you can't have an equal exchange with people. Exchange the same you know type of energy with a person. Okay. Um, if you're working continue doing that because I feel like that's going to bring you guys success definitely okay but approach situations cautiously do not just jump into things okay is what I'm getting for you guys hmm. and maybe this is too to you know be interested even in working things out with this person Cause I don't think that you're interested in that right now because you just feel like uh, we don't get along and that's just it. Okay. 
Maybe it's just showing some interest that you do want to work things out. Hmm. And theirs is to, you know, extend that offer to start over here. Because we have the Ten of Wands here ending something. Um, maybe they need to extend this offer to start over with you guys. With the Ace of Wands there. Hmm. Let's see what the outcome is. What is the outcome for Capricorn? The outcome for Capricorn. Hmm. Continuing to work on yourself. Um, I'm getting that some of you guys will actually start to rebuild this connection with this person as well. Some of you will continue to throw yourself into your work even further. Um, I feel like to kind of, you know, block out some of this energy of this person to distract yourself. But definitely some of you are um, deciding to rebuild, deciding to work on this thing with this person. Let's see what the outcome is for them. What is the outcome for them? Four of Cups. <laughs> you hear me over here huffing because I feel this person is like they're they're really stuck in their ways um, and they really just do not know how to express their feelings. And that is what they're they will continue to do for this upcoming week. Um, is sit and fester and think about how you guys are not coming back together, um, that they don't need anybody and, you know, woo -woo -woo -woo, whatever. Yeah. They're very comfortable in this mode right here because they're not comfortable opening up and sharing their emotions with anybody. They're just not. Okay, but like I said, I definitely do feel that at some point this person is going to give in and um, want to rebuild this thing, want to, you know, speak with you, talk to you, work on this. But they're still going to come across very um, aloof, um, very non-emotional because they have a hard time expressing emotion, this person. Okay, so we have Cancer. Um, any fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, like yourself, even. And um, Earth energy is definitely here, for sure. Um, air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Scorpio is here. Okay. So that's what I have for you guys, and I will be speaking with you soon.